right, guys, let's go over America Lone Warrior, because apparently I never tackled it, and you know what's so funny? I finally realized why. Um, he's actually a pretty garbage for a Lone Warrior. Merrick as a character is good in doses of, you know, using assist, doing this and that. It's just this character, you know, fighting without assist is actually, uh, pretty trash. Because, you know, if you lose one move, you're kind of, like, screwed for the rest. See, the primary, actually, is the biggest reason why I have a problem with this character's Lone Warrior. Because, A, I mean, the primary is usually you mix up game to start things up and all that in a bag of chips. But, uh, yeah, um, definitely not the best Lone Warrior. I mean, Merrick is, you know, a decent character at best for the amount of stuff he does. I mean... You got Blaze here, legit using a 5 copter that's fast as fucking lightning. And you got this slow motherfucker, legit has to wait on certain moves to actually go through for his connection. Sure, he has the damage as a lone warrior, but there's nothing much more I can do to try to counter pretty much Blaze with like little attacks or even like a breaker or two. Because Blaze has little three cost strikes that can just counter, and Luna Wolf goes in the air, making it easier to hit. But you know that's what. That's what makes this um, weird, but kind of like out there type of low warrior for this character in general. I don't know why, because, you know, with Carter, for some reason, it seemed a little bit more smooth, because I guess Carter's moves actually were all good startups. Uh, if the move went through for Carter, all of his moves just went through, period. Uh, Lunar Wolf actually needs, like, his strikes to fully go through to really profit off some damage. But versus people who play, you know, shield assist, that always becomes tricky when it comes to even doing low warrior tech, because, yeah, ancient warrior is slow as shit, I mean, look at that. Because he doesn't really have, like, a shield move as a lone warrior, he's more prone to damage, which is, again, eh, nothing more you can do about that. So I legit was looking for shields this entire game, and when I finally found one, it was too late. I mean, I blocked that. I mean, there's little things you can do, but again, there's like not really enough damage output, lone warrior-wise, to keep up the momentum in a matchup. I mean, I lunar Q would have been nice, but you know that shield came out, and there was nothing more I can do. I mean, some characters just have like better lone warrior moves than the average bear, where it's like, you know, they could work with what they have. It's just lunar wolf doesn't have that because a lot of his breakers are legit killers to him even if he only has breaker slot only the breaker slot only is like terrible it's really fucking bad and i'm kind of mad that that lunar q fucking missed like really a sweep of evil is going to be stronger than lunar q this move that's supposed to hit quick but you know again and you got ancient warrior being slow as fucking titties like for no fucking reason for a legendary to have like a slow ancient warrior attack and believe it or not ancient warrior doesn't even combo properly off its own fucking super meter and that's why i came to the conclusion why i think i never tackled lone warrior because i already knew the answer to this one and i think the answer was going to be obvious i mean once lunar wolf loses his primaries he's very vulnerable to everything else because a lot of his breakers aren't really that flexible for his other his other move anyways to even get like a flow going i mean there's not really much there uh, yeah, you can get it on a Trakita play, a Trakita, a Scorpita player, because you play breakers and shields. So you get a little bit more edge in that, so they can't block you. I don't know why he's playing breakers and shield with a character that's legit breakers and shield. But only stupid people like that you would beat with this character, because if you get your breaker slot only, it's more of a blessing than a curse since your opponent's legit playing breakers and shields. So if you just play a breaker slot only, you win more because they're an idiot playing a character who already has Breaker and Shield and they equipped it more Breakers and Shields. I don't know, man. I don't know what he's smoking, but it is what it is, I guess. I don't know. But yeah, you, this obviously just proves the example. Lunar Wolf is always going to have his issues as a Lone Warrior, which is why we use assists because A, he needs to do what he has to do in a match. Um, he needs an assist to kind of get his little edge going. Some of his moves to kind of get a flow. I mean, there's a lot of things you gotta take into consideration when it comes to playing this character. 
And if you don't, well, that's when everything just flops. But yeah, definitely a D tier lone warrior. Not my favorite, but he's still a good character when you're playing with assist. Thanks for watching. Peace out.